Hi guys, I'm Calvin from Raw Coding. Today, I'll be showing you how to design and add a list from scratch on your Wix website. Hey guys, I'm currently in the Wix editor and I'll be adding a list to this section of my web page. To add a list, press add on the top left, go onto lists and grids, and you will see a variety of different list designs that have been created by Wix. It's important to know that all of these lists have been created by the same template. The only things that have been changed are the images, text, colors, and settings used for each one. So I'm just going to drag one into the editor. It has been designed for holiday bookings. So these elements have just been added to the list cell. So there's an image over here, there's some text, and as you can see, you can change all of this and add your own stuff. So I'm going to take this, delete all the elements and basically start from scratch and show you how to do everything yourself. So I'm just going to delete the pictures, the writing and the buttons as well. And then what I'm going to do is delete the cells itself, press one of them, say manage items and you can delete the item three and item two over here. So now we will be left with a list template with a single cell inside of it. Before making this video, I created my own list design on PowerPoint to give myself an idea of what I would like to create in Wix. So this is the design I'm going to be creating on my Wix website. I'm going to add three separate cells with different colors. I'm going to add these pictures into each of the cell. I'll add some text over here. And I'll also add a semi-transparent box overlay with some lines on the end which I think looks quite nice. I'm going to upload this image and pop it into the Wix editor so I can transfer this design into the list on Wix easier. So I'm just going to upload it now. I've uploaded my design that I created in PowerPoint and I'm going to add it to page now. So this is what I'm going to try and recreate in the list above. To start, I'm going to resize the first cell by double clicking on it going to drag the bottom down and I'm going to drag this out all the way to the end. Next, I'm going to double click on the first cell again, press design and I'm going to add some corners to it. I'm going to say 30 pixels. So now it looks quite similar to the design I created on PowerPoint. Next, I'm going to select manage items and I'm going to duplicate these cells twice. One, two. So now we have three separate cells in the list. I can see that the gap between the cells is a bit large. So I'm going to click on the entire list once, press layouts and reduce the spacing between items over here. There we go. Next, I'm going to change the colors of each cell. Double click on the first one, press change background, select color, and I'm going to choose a light blue. On the second one, I'm going to do the same thing, change background, color, add a pink. The third one, double click on it, press color, and add a green. I know the colors don't look exactly the same, but uh, they will do for now. Next, I'm going to add some text. I'm going to press add text. I'm going to choose heading two, pop it in there. For my convenience, it's automatically added it to each cell in the list. So I'm going to change the first one to coding tutorials. I'm going to change the second one to web design and I'm going to change the third one to building computers. I'll be editing the text to make it look similar to the one I designed previously. Next, I'll be adding a line to the list. Press add, go on shape and I'm going to press on one of the themed lines at the top. Attach it to strip, rotate them. I'm going to actually double click on them. Maybe choose a stronger line. I quite like that one actually. I've uploaded these images to my Wix files and I'll just add them to the list now. Press add, image, my image uploads. I'm going to select the first image, press add to page, drag it in over here and Wix will automatically duplicate the image onto the rest of the list cells. To change the other images, select them, click on change image and just choose the next one and repeat for the last one. Finally, as an added design, I'm just going to add this transparent box 
onto the list over here. To add the box, press add, click on box, and just choose the top one over here. I'm going to edit this box by double clicking on it, press customize design, full color and opacity. I'm going to choose a gray. I'm going to bring the background down to 30%. Now I'm just going to resize this. Press attach to item, and then it will be attached to the list over here. Finally, I'm just going to add a quick page title, and then we will have completed the design of our list. To add your page title, press add, text, heading one, bring it to the top. So now we have completed our list and copied it exactly as it is from the image design that we uploaded. I'm just going to delete the image. And as you can see, this is the final list. If we quickly go back on the lists, the Wix templates really are great as you can just change the elements and you won't need to resize and set up everything yourself. But as a learning curve, I thought it would be great to just start from scratch. If you are interested in joining Wix, please do click on the link in the video description below. It basically tells Wix that you joined through me and helps me out a lot. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you would like to watch more tutorials on Wix, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and take a look at my other videos. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.